When you work with AutoCAD, you will often find it useful to have more than one drawing file open at a time. And some of those drawings will have multiple drawing tabs or paper space tabs in them. Navigating through that mess can be difficult and sluggish and oftentimes confusing. How do you know which drawing you need or what tab you need, especially if they aren't your files? Well, a very quick method in AutoCAD for Mac is to press the control and down arrow at the same time. Now, I've already opened up several files at random, different project files and things that we're going to be using throughout this training video. I would like for you to do the same, just to open up a couple of them. It doesn't matter how many or which. Just type in the word open, press return, browse to where your files are saved at, pick one, move down the list a little bit, press the shift key and left click, and it will open up a list of files for you. Whichever ones you get is fine. We just need drawings open. So if you press the control button and the down arrow on your keyboard, both at the same time, your Macintosh will put a list of all of your drawings open for you. You have a bit of a visual display here and down here as well. Now you can just use your left and right arrow keys to navigate through the list of other files. And when you're ready to open one of them, press enter. Or on the display, you can just click any one of those icons to open up that file. That's pretty quick and easy and probably a really good way to do it. But inside AutoCAD, you have a couple of options yourself with the status bar. Come down here to the bottom. Right here you have Model. Left click on that. It will have quick access to all of the paper space and model tabs in your current file that you have open. The check mark means that is current. So this model tab or the chapter five project drawing is current. These are the different tabs. I can click on one and it will open that up for me. It's layout because we're in the layout one. This gives you the name of it. If I go to a, another drawing, I can select that. It takes me to the model tab. Then here is the paper space tab. I can get to it, I can use it very quickly that way, and it's real nice, especially if you know what's there. Now, if you're not exactly sure what the other tabs are, you can use our other option here, and that is the show drawings and layouts. If I left click on here, it will give you a preview on the left column here of what the drawings are, and when you select one, it will show you here on the right your layout tabs. If there are any, you can scroll through the wheel here, it will show you what they are, and then you can just double click on the one you want to access. So that's kind of the easy, quick way on how to get to the different tabs if you have multiple files open all at the same time. And as you work with AutoCAD, you're going to find that this is going to happen quite often. You'll be working with data from outside vendors, other drafters, and other just bits of information that you need to put together to work into your drawings. And oftentimes you will have to have multiple instances of your drawings open at the same time. You'll be working on drawings, you know, one through five and have to make changes to a base file that will affect them all. And so you'll see that this will happen quite often. So you'll have to get used to and comfortable with navigating throughout your open files. Now, if you're used to working with the AutoCAD on the PC for Windows, there was something you could do by pressing the control and tab key. It would toggle up or down through your open AutoCAD files. That doesn't work here in the Mac OS. So you'll just have to use one of these others, which work perfectly well.